fucking game. Theo Vaughn shot out. Perfecto. All right, all right, baby. Good morning. How you doing, James? Good evening to you, I guess. Chelsea, hello. Isaac, what's happening? Candy, hello. Bonnie and Randy, hello, hello. We've gotten close, Randy. We've gotten close. If you can guess my number, I'll sign it. Jonathan, I'm going to throw out a crazy number, and it's going to be 29. Did I get it? Did I get it? Did I get it? Lethal Ted, what's cracking? Paul John, hello. Michael, hello. KC, I'm always feeling it, man. It just never happens. It just never happens. It's the lack of sleep that I've been getting, I promise. Brandon, Jose, what's cracking? Yesterday was number two. Today is number one. Mm. Number nine, number nine. All right, number nine. Lucky number nine. Only top fives today. Joe, come on, man. You're going to be disappointed, like, right away. I haven't had a warm-up match yet. That's not a good idea. You don't want to throw that out there. Oh, man. I'm tired today, y'all. I'm tired today, y'all. What's up, Philly? RT Amanda? Andy, hi there. Fair, welcome back. Natalie, hello. Travis and Athena, what's cracking? Get those dirty dogs. I'm going to try, Lethal Ted. I'm going to try. Um, you guys might not want to go top 10 on this first one. I'm a little tired. Might need a warm-up. Hurting a little bit today. Tristan, 23 this game. Michael Jordan in the house. 25, top 25. Thank you, Andy. We're going to get it. We're going to get it today. We're going to get it. They're still doing this buyback thing, man. Get a little water. Seeing a 28 there. 28. Oh, I, uh, I jacked my back up, like, right in the middle. And so, come 4 a.m., I'm awake. I fight it for about a half hour. And then uh, around 4.30, I say, ah, hell with it. And I just get up. <laughs> After a couple hours, it loosens up. It's loosened up now, but, you know, I can still feel it a little bit. Couple, couple 18s. Number one. We're number one. What? Six. 37. Jared, what's up? Welcome to the stream. Bree, welcome to the stream with a 17. Got another 23. Got another Michael Jordan. Jordan. Air Jordan. Um, Jose, honestly, bro, I think I Sammy Sosa'd myself like a week ago. I had a crazy sneeze, and I legit think I broke a rib. And... After I hold still for a long time, my body starts healing, right? Like when I sleep. And then after a certain amount of time when I move, I, it feels like someone's just stabbing me in the back. So I think like the muscle came off the rib or I ripped a little cartilage like you can in the front. Like when a rib separates from your sternum and that cartilage gets jacked up. Um, so I think I did something like that. I will say this though. Last night was the first night that I got like five hours. So that was a good thing. Our light is green. That is good. You guys have 40 seconds to place your bets. 
Guys, we're gonna spike ourselves like John Lithgow and Ricochet. What? Y'all haven't seen that movie? <laughs> oh, I didn't work. Shout out to anybody who's seen Ricochet. One of Denzel Washington's first movies is like the leading man kind of movie. Showed what he could do in that kind of genre. An underrated flick, by the way. It's actually pretty good. I think Ice T's in it too. Dang, that's a serious sniper rifle. Practice, practice I can see everything. Now. Someone died. Did you guys hear that? <laughs> All right, here we go. Here we go, y'all. More problems, Officer Prince reporting for duty, sir. Are you ready to jump? Not really, sir. Light's still green. Light's still green, if you know what I mean. Voice is a little choppy in the game, though. But our stream light's green. So I'll take it. I'll take it. There's a fire station. Here we go. Fireman Fred, that roof is red. We're gonna be number one and we won't be dead. Wasn't my best. Wasn't my best fireman Fred freestyle. I think that guy's going to our fire station. He's a digital firefighter for sure. Maybe we go to this one over here. It doesn't look like anybody went over there. Oh, uh, that guy's going there. All right, maybe we're not gonna be a fireman right now. Maybe we're just gonna be a regular civilian. Civilian Fred. <laughs> that sucks. <laughs> civilian Fred sucks. Civilian Fred needs all the armor he can get his hands on. And the cache! Give me that cache! <laughs> I like Civilian Fred. I like something like a dog that's so ugly it's cute. Like that's such a bad name, it's kind of like, you know, it's kind of growing on me. Not exactly gun friendly, are we? Let's go find some guns. Oh, baby, let's go find some guns. Oh, baby, these are a lot of stairs. Now, I don't know if that made you guys want to throw it, but I almost did. Now, come on. I hear a creep. Give me something good. We got the cash flow going. We just don't really, don't really have any good guns. Where's all the good stuff, man? Not much of a sniper. As our regular viewers know, claim or insurance when things go boom. Okay. No reason to stay here. Well, let's see where the circle's going. We're going out and around, my friends. Let's check out this cool little angular looking house. With the A-frame design. 
Nice. What is that? Better than that. I was a sniper. I don't really know if one of those is more powerful than the other, so we're going to stick with what we've got. And uh, do a little Claymore Insurance right here. Claymore Insurance. When things go boom. Not to be confused with proxy insurance or proximity insurance. Hey. Oh, I could get plugged right there. <laughs> getting shot at repeatedly hi everybody how's it going you should sing more often oh yeah that's sweet smooth voice thank you vasco welcome back to the stream when you need more go claim more da -da 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 -da. you are you trying to say jake from state farm is better insurance coverage than claymore come on now oh the ihop that's what it, I, you know, I've never eaten at IHOP, but yes, they do the A-frame. There's a house up where I live that's like way 70s, tucked away in one of the mountains, and they have the full-on A-frame with full, like, uh, 70s smoke glass ceilings. Dude, it's so crazy. All right, all right. You've been using claymores on buy stations? Yeah, I've done that before. I put one next to a crate in a room that I was hiding in. And the guy came in to get the crate. The claymore went off. He turned towards that, and then I got a kill. Which was a waste of a claymore, but whatever. It was funny. Everybody, though, should have claymore insurance, to be honest. You need to dump your insurance today. And go to ClaymoreInsurance.net and uh, we'll give you 20% off your uh, not only your first years of payments, but your first deductible as well. And we guarantee to beat. Holy crap. I'm dying. Thermite everywhere. Um, And we guarantee to beat, not match, beat your current rates. Dude, I wasn't even like full up. Next time, wait till I get my armor up, you jerk. Good God, everybody wants me dead. Come on. Let Big Daddy. Let Big Daddy get his armor in. There we go. Big Daddy's back. Big Daddy's back. Everybody's trying to kill your boy, man. Okay, we got some evil over there. Oh, it must be a dude up on the roof. Okay, we need to get the hell out of here because everybody knows where we're at. Bad guy over there that can shoot us. Alright, we're gonna go out this way.
Wish me luck, guys. We are wide open right now. Ugh, you stupid idiot, Freddy. farmhouse if we can. I think someone might be up there. Oh, lovely. That's exactly what we needed right now. Okay, you guys, we're not dead yet. You know, why did that guy try to kill us earlier? Why didn't he want to do the circle of friendship, man? Circle of friendship's where it's at. For those of you unfamiliar with the circle of friendship, it's where no players shoot each other, and they all just get closer and closer and closer in the middle, and it's whoever holds their breath the longest that's who wins that circle of friendship and it's for sure never been done before on any battle royale type game but it would be crazy funny if it happened so some streamer far more popular than me make it happen man all right here we go I didn't get that full? There was heat in those bullets. Come on. I guarantee you she was on the brink of death. That's crazy. We put some rounds. And they were stopping power rounds, too. Oh, there's a jailbreak imminent, y'all. Jailbreak coming. All right, kids. Where to go? Where to go? Could hide out up there. Could be right where that guy's going, though. But it could be fun. I feel like I... Oh, God, there's somebody right there. <laughs> Yo, I thought that was the multi-level park structure that you could land on. Not some random spire to get murdered on. Play again. Did anyone get that? I don't think anybody had me placed in that bad. I told you the first game was going to be bad. That would be the opposite of the circle of friendship. You only get to respawn if you have like $4,500 or more on you when you die. No, I haven't seen the, the whatever finisher it was you were talking about. Decent warm up. The first one's our mulligan, that's what we call it. Eight, lucky number eight. All right, you guys. I'm seeing your bets. I'm seeing your bets. Respect. We're going to make it happen. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. <clears throat> For anybody new to the stream that... uh that's unfamiliar with how we play. If you pick the place that I finish in, uh, you can win an autographed picture. I'll personalize it, write whatever you want on it. All you have to do is take a picture of when you placed your bet 
Um, it has to be before I jump out of the airplane on the real one. This is the practice one. That's why you see the timer up there. And uh, if you pick correctly, I'll sign it. All right, whatever you want. We cover all the postage and handling. You just take a photo and you send an address. You're comfortable with us shipping the photo too. Um, we had nine winners last week. I think we've had one or two winners this week. Um, and yeah, this is the final one of the week. So get in there. Uh, give us a follow. Get a free pick. And uh, yeah. And don't forget tonight, 5 p.m., episode two of Geg Talk. Um, it's about 20 plus some odd minutes long. Well, that guy had a bird. That was cool. Um, it's uh, it's a really good episode. We're going to take you from Red Dead Redemption 2 all the way to Quentin Tarantino in tonight's Gag Talk. So please tune into that. It's at 5 p.m. Pacific time. And tomorrow, every Friday at 3 p.m. Pacific time, Settlers of Catan. And we'll announce our special guest for tomorrow's Catan stream on Gag Talk tonight at 5 p.m. Pacific time. Boom, I got all the promos in before we jump. Let's see here, let's see here. There's firehouses over here. Boom, there's one right there. Fireman Fred, what's the deal, baby? Man, that stream light's green, but the sound feels a little choppy on my end. It's weird. The light is green, the trap is clean. Let's do this. No sneaky drops on us. I think we're good. Fireman Fred in the house, baby. Choo-choo train, Fred. Right over there. Thank you. A little bit choppy. Me no like. Alrighty. I always feel at home when I'm in my digital firehouse. And I know what you're thinking, Freddie, what's the life of a digital fireman like? Well, you have to have a lot of courage, a lot of digital courage to get the job done. You can't be afraid of fake digital fires, or fake digital explosions. And if you are, then it's not the job for you. We're going to go with Tem Holta. Just because I like the way that sounds, not because I know the difference. Money, give me all that money. Shoot, we already got a rebuy if we need it. Okay, nothing good there. Up, up and away in my digital, my digital firehouse. Another crate. We've got a trophy system. Fantastic. And a throwing knife. All right, where are we at? Oh, wait a minute. Did we pick a spot that's kind of middle? Noise. It won't last. It'll probably end up like over by the hospital or something, but we're going to play for a little bit. Let me see if this circle is better. Well, at least one person knows where we are. Twenty one seconds, twenty one seconds. Be sick if someone was up there. <clears throat> All right, let's take a peek. Nothing. Fantastic. All right. Well, we're safe. Not top 100 yet. I want you guys to win. 
Let's get some winners. So while we're safe, I can say hello again. Danger Zone Gaming, welcome back. Michael McCarthy, how about we catch a train on the next one? I'm already fireman fredding it right now, but I'll jump on on the next one. You guys are going to want to bet some early deaths on the next stream. <laughs> Chris, 3 p.m. Pacific time. 3 p.m. for Settlers of Catan. 3 p.m. Pacific time. Doo -doo 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 -doo. Oh, your picture came through, Candace? Awesome. You see? You play, you win. And unlike Vegas, we don't take your dough. You don't leave a loser here. You leave a winner. That was a rifle, not a door. Let it ride, baby. Spam the armor munner. Oh, so you spam it. You just tap it and it'll go in quicker. Okay, cool. Thanks for the tip. Tristan Bremer. Do a film quiz? Oh, like, oh, what was the last one we did? What was it from a fish called Wanda? Yeah. All right, I'll do another one. I'll do another one. Let's see. I got to think of it. I got to think of it. All right, I got one. I got one. This isn't as uh, highbrow humor as, as Monty Python, but it's still a line that, made, that always made me laugh. All right, ready? It's two people. When I look this way, I'm one person. When I look this way, I'm the other, okay? Here we go. Let's blow this guy away. Blow this guy away. What movie? <laughs> oh, yes, the latter, Jonathan. Oh, yes, she will be mine. Oh, what's that from? That's an easy one. Demolition Man. Very good. Demolition Man. Very, very good. Random movie written by Dan Waters. Uh, Dan Waters also wrote Heathers back in the day. Sick, sick, dark comedy starring Christian Slater and Winona Ryder at like their hungriest as actors. Like, they just absolutely killed it. He also wrote The Penguin Draft of Batman Returns. Um, they brought in another writer and added a whole bunch of other stuff. He also wrote uh, Demolition Man and a ton of other stuff as well. Really cool writer. And is the brother of Mark Waters, who directed Mean Girls. And his first film that he ever directed was an indie called The House of Yes, which I got to be in back in the day with Parker Posey. So there's a little, there's another connection. See, you just got a gag talk without even watching gag talk. Oh my God. Still getting that circle love. Heathers is a great movie, Brandon. If you guys haven't seen that film, it's rated R for sure, but it is a dark comedy. It's not the kind of movie you would laugh at with your mom sitting next to you, unless you and your mom are super cool. But if she was gone, you'd be like, yo, that's, that's pretty good. He also wrote a line that a lot of movies have stolen over the years in like different ways. And I think it was called like Happy Campers or something like that was the movie. And the camp counselor is going to humiliate one of the kids um, in the cabin. And he's like, boys and girls, we have a bedwetter. Now, I don't want to say any names, but his initials are James Grossman, or whatever the kid's name is, and he just points at him, and the kid is just shattered. And a lot of movies have stolen that over the years. <coughs> Excuse me. All right, 78th, 78th, here we go. Come on, come on. Let's get a winner, let's get a winner, y'all. Never seen Heathers. Oh, you gotta check that one out. Gotta check that out. 
Don't forget to move so you don't go inactive. Oh, God. Candace, I don't think that was us, though, on that one. When we went up on that on that top, like, corn, corn tower, corn silo, whatever we were on, we were laying there maybe 20 seconds. Maybe 20 seconds. Boom. Booted. That was booty. That's what that was. They did us wrong. They did us wrong that day. They did Team Gaghead very, very wrong. Oh, look at that poor bastard. He already died. That was us last time. <laughs> All right. Now we can finally see where this circle's going to go. Oh, it already went. It's time for us to go, y'all. Where do we want to run to? What do you think, guys? We don't want to go where that guy just got capped on. Promenade East, maybe? Maybe that building up there? Oh, there's another firehouse right there, baby. What? You know where we're going. Fireman Fred! Your friendly neighborhood digital firefighter. Where real men who lack the courage to fight fires in real life go to fight fake fires. Come on, Fireman Fred. Come on, baby. Don't worry about that UAV. Y'all aren't looking for me. I'm a firefighter. I'm not a killer. I'm a peaceful man. That'll, that'll take that armor. A peaceful man that'll take some armor. Shout out to all the real firefighters that are way tougher than me. Could probably beat me in this game too. That kind of sucks to admit, but whatever. <laughs> hey, I'll take that instead of this. You know what I'm saying? Climb, you fool. Dragons, what? Now I have a riot shield. Ho, ho, ho. Now what's up? Now Fireman Fred's looking a little better. Now Fireman Fred's looking a little bit better. The fam is good, Miracle Allen. Thank you for asking. So middle is behind us, just a touch. Probably that building there. I know that building is covered. That one. I don't know about that one. It's gotta be. This fool's on the train chilling. For sure someone's close by. Let's see where this circle's going, my friends. Okay, that did not go where I thought it was going to go. Be fast, baby, be fast. Thank you. 
Yep, someone's up there. Okay, but at least we were right about someone being in that other building. <laughs> It. I don't see the beep. Oh, it's got to be him over there. Yeah. Okay. We're all right. We're not in the best spot, but we're okay. in here. I don't think he landed on our roof. right before the hospital have some middleage in there I'd like to wait out this last minute though <clears throat> oh they won't let me uh, mount the gun there cold-blooded okay 30 seconds be patient buddy be patient <coughs> Not much longer now. it all right here. Dang it! Oh, I forgot I had that shield. I gotta respawn. I keep forgetting you got those rebuys. This is gonna be tricky now. We're not gonna have much. Do we go? You know what? I'm gonna do something kind of crazy and I'm gonna go for the spot we died in and hope some of my crap is still there. Her 
hurts my feelings, but okay. Get in that house, boy. I right, forget it. I can't close the door. someone with some armor to be real dumb right now. That guy took all my good stuff! Here we go. Come on in, buddy. I guess he went up the stairs. Alright y'all, no more rebuys. 34 or better. 33 or better. <clears throat> They're dropping like flies. I wish that guy could have just would have left me one armor. Just one. Some toy blocks there. If this was Fallout, we could turn those into wood, build some settlements. Game time. Should have stayed with Roush. All right, did we get a winner? 21, 21, 21. No, I do not have the Rona. I have allergies like a mug, though. Anybody get it? Anybody Anybody win? <clears throat> oh, Jordan. Cody, did you win? Come on. Did you win, Cody? I definitely have seen Kung Fu Hustle, yes. Yeah, congratulations, first winner. First winner. Nice, congratulations, Cody Fonseca. Um, take a picture of your, uh, of your prediction. Send it to us right here at facebook.com uh, forward slash gaghead. And uh, give us that address you're comfortable with us shipping it to. We cover all the shipping, all that good stuff. And uh, you get a picture signed, and I'll write whatever you want on it. So thank you for playing, Cody. You're awesome. Let's jump in this next game. Let's get another winner right now. Oh, the photos I have available, I have a, and I know you did last summer, photo, Scooby-Doo, um, Iron Bull, some James Vegas, some Canans, and some regular ones when I didn't have gray hair. Congratulations, Cody. Congratulations. Oh, yeah, you guys. I'm going to jump on the train. You're going to want to bet a high number. Uh, and when I say high, I mean high. Not like, oh, number two, number three, because this is going to get bloody. I think it was Joey that asked for the train jump. Uh, so, Joey, this one's for you. If not, nothing is for you. <clears throat> train jump. Crack, crack. 
crack, crack. Ooh, that one actually cracked. There we go. Here you go. Listen to this. There you go, kids. <laughs> Don't crack your knuckles. Arthritis sucks. Well, I'm going to go on that tower too, bro. How come you're the only one? I'm coming to hang out with you, bro. Whether you like it or not. No. <laughs> yeah, I'm back. I'm coming up, bro. You better be ready. How did I die? Oh, yes, jerk. I was about to kill that fool. <laughs> Seven, six. Natalie, I don't think 20 is going to be... Oh, you guys are going 20s, man. All right. Yes. Yes, it does suck. Little Terminator, or no, little uh, RoboCop 2. RoboCop 2. Almost said Terminator 2. <coughs> RoboCop 2. All right, you guys. Train jump. <coughs> Train is over by that Ferris wheel, right? Man, am I even going to be able to? No backstabbers. I haven't been backstabbed this whole stream. Oh, there it comes. He missed because he can't shoot straight, but. Scrub. Scrub, scrub. With your punk ass. Alright, guys. Do we see the train yet? No. There it is. Alright, we're heading straight toward it. Here we go. Oh, this guy's trying to jump on too. We're about to have some problems. There's only room for one of us on this here train, you understand? Oh man! <laughs> Maybe we got we got enough money. We're not dead yet. <laughs> that sucks. That sucks. <laughs> what a terrible idea you guys had. <laughs> Alrighty, we are gonna. Well, we'll go to this bar. <laughs> Somebody already cleaned this out. I spammed it, bro, but it didn't put the armor in. It just switched weapons a lot. But I tried, man. And I'll try again one day. Yeah, we'll take that. For now.
Through, bro. I know you're close. Just come through. Ah, I had to reload. Sorry, guys. I did not have the weapons I wanted. Dude, that's tough starting on that train. Y'all are psychopaths trying to do that. Hell no. Ain't nobody gonna, well, if you start betting 120, you'll start winning if I do that. Who said pie? Who's making pie? Just hold down. The All right, Lethal Ted, I'll hold it. Yeah, that's what I normally do is just hold it down. Did you really have 123? Holy crap. Never mind, Daniel. Carry on. <laughs> yeah, someone said pie, and now I'm thinking about pie. Like some key lime pie. That would be good. I like something with a little tartness to it. Something just a little sour. <clears throat> All right, this is the one, you guys. Conductor Fred does not have what it takes, you guys. Eighth, lucky eight. Let's do it. We're not going to count that last game. Just gonna throw it away. Sixteenth. <laughs> Robert, you almost won, man. Guys, here we go. Here we go. This is the one. Jose Santiago, I like that if that's your bet. I like the way you place that. If I'm in 67 and there's an opportunity to run out there, or 66th, I guess would be safer. I'll do it. Up, 
up up. Cash money. I thought I saw somebody there. Not loving our primary weapon very much. Let's get to improvement. Not very good. No crates, man. It's crazy. Mm. Stick with this. Just don't shoot at me, guys. I'm your friend. Circle of friendship. Come on. This is the one. Circle of friendship. Could happen. No, Freddy. It will never happen. Yeah, I know. There are no friends in the war zone, bro. I don't need whatever's over there. Some more armor would be good. Yeah, baby. You know how to take care of your boy. Our final tower. It's the final tower. I'll take that extra rocket. Okay. Up in those that farm area. We'll see if it shifts that far. What's up, people? Randy's going to log in, make sure his bed. He's like, bam, 27, got him. <laughs> nice loot. This is the one. Leo, welcome to the stream. Rafe, welcome to the stream. Scorpions fan. Yeah, that was their remix they did special for my stream. Um, I'm cool with those guys, so they wrote that, and uh, I just performed it. Enemy, enemy UAV overhead. I, what? I did. I could have. You don't know. All right, I didn't. Where do you do? You guys think it's going to be on the east side of the of the arroyo, or the or the west side of the arroyo? You see what I'm saying? You think the final circle will be over here or over here? This is what the Arroyo is, this. What do you guys think? Welcome all the new people. Uh-oh. I heard something. What the hell was that? Well, I just gotta tell. Isn't it better to just stay at the center? Yeah, but I have to get to the center first, and the circle moves and shifts. So what's center on the first circle isn't gonna be the final center, if that makes sense. Lumber or farmland? Yeah, Randy, I think you're probably right. I think lumber's gonna be where it's at. armor up there. Climb. Oh crap, 
that there is somebody right below me. Don't do it, man. <laughs> Circle of friendship, bro. Don't do it. Me kill you, man. Don't do it, bro. Him. We went dead silence. We're running for it. We're going to try to get to the lumber yard. I think we're going to be all right. Only two armor. Like a little bit more. <sighs> Running down the middle of the street. I must be crazy. God, there's two of them right there. All right, we're out of their sight at least. Yeah, oh. Holy crap. Oh, it was farmland. Okay. Grocery store. All right, homeboy just went through there. Got two chances at a claim. Nice. At least I got some more. So the only ways in here, I think you can sneak. Yeah, you can get in through there, which sucks bad. And then this window here. But I might have a shot on that guy if he's up on the top floor. safe in here at all. Damn it. All right, we got a respawn at least. It's going to be tight now. Okay. It's gonna be tough. I kind I have a little bit of an idea of brewing. I won't be able to stay up here long enough to see where the circle goes.
don't know, man. We're gonna go for it. All right, looks like we're going to hang out in this barn house. <laughs> no, I knew someone could shoot me down, Candy. I was thinking about landing on top of one of the silos, but there were still so many people left. I uh, I don't think it would have worked. want to know where this circle's going to be. Don't you understand? All right. You never know. It could shift right here. We don't know. We don't know where it's going to be. I need ammo. Oh, you're right. Too bad uh, there's not too much laying around. <laughs> As of right now, this is our ammo situation, my man. But it's going to change. Because we're going to get the heck out of here. Seriously, that's what you're going to do to me. Okay. It's going to be on the other damn side of the ditch. Stealing this guy's car. Sorry, dude. <laughs> you have to just deal with certain things in life. And that's one of them. Have a nice jog. what we needed. Here we go, here we go. Austin Powers. <laughs> Definitely footsteps above us, I think. Anybody comes out that elevator, <laughs> I just feel bad. But we need the armor, so. Too bad for them. <laughs> Um, to answer your question, I do watch pro wrestling still. Hang on, I'm hearing all kinds of stuff. And uh, it doesn't bother me that no crowd's there. I 
I promise it bothers the business though. It's a lot of money gone every single night on those house shows. They're not going to drop in on this roof. There's already somebody up there. Man, it's weird hearing all those footsteps. <laughs> Miracle Allen. You starting to feel the, the pressure? You feeling the stress? All right, let's see where the circle goes. All right, kids. This final circle is going to be out in the open. I'm not near your numbers yet, so I don't want to go up to the roof and kill this guy just yet in case I die. But in 40-some seconds, we're probably going to have to either way. 3 p.m. Pacific time here in Los Angeles, Rafe. Yeah, there's definitely a guy above me, but I just if I activate it, he'll know I'm below him. Sixteen, number sixteen, all right, all right. We're getting close. Fifteen seconds, y'all. Same spot. From where? Holy sniper. We got our respawn still. I could land on that building and get down inside maybe. Get my stuff back at least. Claymores will have gone off, correct? Yeah, that sucks. Oh, that's brutal. Well, that's fair, though. Oh. What's fair in a game? Hold up, chopper, dude. Fine, I'll blow you up. Sniper was up there, so I just want to kind of. Oh no, he was there on that building, wasn't he? Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. So we're gonna hide here. Bus, bus, and bus. Ah! Darn. 
Someone said 17. I know someone said 17. Come on. Come on, somebody won. We got a winner. We got a winner. Come on, come on. Anyone? I don't even think I heard his. Uh, I don't play Fortnite, Angel. Um, I don't even think I heard his parachute open. Maybe I did. Ah, oh, 17 last game. Isaac, keep playing, man. Keep playing. It's free, brother. <laughs> Did anyone say it? Oh, my God. 16. I wish I would have got that. All right, we'll get it. We'll get it. This is the one, y'all. This is the one. All right, so if you have it, all you have to do is go back into the stream and take a picture of when you claimed it, and we'll put that up against the uh, up against the time code on the thing. And if you did, we'll send you a picture. If you're lying, nothing for you. Andrew, congratulations, Andrew. So all you got to do is what I just said. Take a photo of where you said it and uh, send it to us right here at facebook.com forward slash gaghead. And uh, put a P.O. box or an address, whatever you're comfortable with us shipping it to. And we cover all the cost. And uh, congratulations. <laughs> Thanks, Lethal Ted. Uh, <laughs> Jake, welcome to the stream. Didn't see you before. Didn't see you before, my man. All right, here we go, here we go. Let's all take a drive, oh baby. Let's go take a drive, oh baby. Let's go take a drive, oh baby. Let's go take a drive. Careful, you could have hurt me, man. Sheesh. Could have blown up my truck. What's wrong with you? Hello, friend. Honk. <laughs> that was too funny. That guy's bird's just chewing up that guy's eyeballs. <laughs> this game's funny, man. All right, we got some bets in there. We got some bets. 23, 13, 35, I'm liking it, I'm liking it. All right, you guys, bets are about to be over. I'm being stingy with that real estate on this one. above us. That guy looks like a digital firefighter if I ever saw one. Circle of friendship, guys. I'm hearing bullets. What's up with a circle of friendship? Fireman Fred, let's get it. Whoa, did that guy just drop into the... Damn it. I'm not trying to have that kind of heat right away.
crate. I just don't see you. Not good with LMGs. Peace, bro. Oh! All right, at least I get a respawn. Oh, that was brutal. That's what you get when you sprint. some in this house and then we'll work our way northwest around the back of the quarry and that's what we're going to try to do too much heat and you are not ready my man you are not ready for it damn it already cleaned out We're a little lean. A little bit lean. Come on, make that jump. Okay, we have armor. We have nothing because we fell off the roof. <laughs> and we can't jump back up there. Take two. Perfect. Slim pickings, my man. Where's this guy going? Grocery store? Somebody's shooting at us. At least I think it was us. single shots were coming from but I feel like they for sure know where we are it's alright though Okay, guys, we've reset. 
Everything's good. Everything's going to be okay. Hi, everyone. Should set up traps. Colby, welcome, welcome. How do I take my coffee? I take it black with one sugar. That's how I prefer my coffee. Seventy-three digital warriors remain. Okay, guys, here we go. Here we go. <clears throat> Twenty seconds. Get to that. That was him. Okay, guys, we can do a little bit of dirty work now. Get that dirty work in. Dude was like, bro, what about the circle of friendship? All right, we need ammunition. And we need it now. guys 52 remain oh what a spot up there where's that ladder you can't get the ladder except from the roof of the building I guess That's a sexy little tower, though. I kind of want to go there. Oh, the little grenade? I thought it was a decoy. Yeah, it's a decoy. I don't ever use those. Number 23, Michael Jordan. Jordan. Jordan.
man, I want to be up there so bad. I get killed as soon as I got up there, but I don't know. Climbing the trees is fun, you guys. Climbing ladders is cool too. Oh, hello, friend. <laughs> Man, how you gonna do me like that? So, in a little bit of trouble if he does. It's going to be back at that house we were at, you guys. That's going to be the final circle, I think. I know what you're saying, Freddy. Don't do it. But we're going to do it. This is the one! Look at this dude. He's going in. And we're going this way. <laughs> each other hopefully that guy just took that top spot up there you see that dude all right let's see where this circle goes He's just on the other side. Of it. Man, I don't know where this middle's gonna be. Take this. We don't have any armor. I'm going to hang out right here. <laughs> something be happy with that oh we still have claymores those are always fun Okay, guys, 28th, we're coming up on that Jordan number. Gunshots for the back. No gunshots, Leo. 
No gunshots to the back. Hide in the bushes. Ten seconds. You can do it. Thanks, you guys. Everyone's like, stay in the bushes. We're staying in the bushes. <laughs> We're maintaining our bushy coverage. Let's go 14. Come on, 25. Oh, that's your favorite spot to get killed at. Perfect, Jonathan. <laughs> Randy, how can you say I'm camping? I don't even have a gun. I'm not even camping a position. I can't see anybody. I'm just hoping they run by. This is called no pride hide, not camping. It's a good spot. There will be no landscaping of this bush. There will only be my existence within the bush. We're remaining in the bush. We're like the burning bush from the three amigos. All right, we got some action. Here comes a little action. Never mind, drove by. We have no action. 23, Michael Jordan, Jordan. It's called strategic placement. <laughs> Oh, crap. Well, it's game on now. It is game on now. Here they come, wherever they are, wherever they are. Can't see anything. All right, he's on the left side above us. Someone got him. <laughs> We're still in it. About to get tight, you guys. It's about to get tight. Leo, I didn't think I was going to make it, bro. I got no armor at all. I get touched, I'm dead. And that circle's about to get tight. Okay, okay. We're still alive, you guys. Fern Gully Freddy, that's right, man. The Bushmaster. I'm like the Bushwhackers, old school 80s WWF uh, tag team from Australia. That's what they did when they walked out to the ring. They were crazy, too. Their gimmick was just being crazy Australians. Thought I heard somebody. Come on, 12, she says. Come on, 12. You're like shaking dice at the craps table right now. <laughs> hard eight. Come on, hard eight. 
Lucky number 13. Good advice, Leo. Thank you. I'll stay away from the bullets until the end. All right. Here we go. Where did that guy go that died? Oh, come on! Those two dudes are working together. Oh, he's going to kill that guy next. Well played, sir. Well played. Oh, mama. That was so close, you guys. Oh, that was so close. Hello, everyone. Rafe, I couldn't stay there much longer. The gas was coming, my man. Did anybody have it? Did anyone have it? Was it lucky 13? Was that the final number? Did someone win? Was it 12th? Somebody won. Come on. What place did I get? Bree! Wait, Bree, have you won yet? Do we have two winners? You fin I finished 11th. Who got 11? Who got a Bree got 11? Michael Jordan lost. That's okay. Randy got 11. Nice. Nice, you guys, three winners today, at least three. There might even be four if that other person uh, got their got their guess in in time. Four winners this week, that's awesome. I mail out all the photos every Friday. Um, I don't think we've had a week where we didn't have a winner, so congratulations to you guys. This is a fun stream. I'm gonna keep doing it even if I do eventually get a first place. Um, I really like hooking this up and I like seeing your bets and I like the tension. You guys are like betting on racehorses. Come on, six. Come on, six, you bum, you nag. Ah. Um, I had a ton of fun, you guys, tonight at uh, in about five hours, five hours and 20 minutes at 5 p.m. Pacific time, episode two of Geg Talk. And we're talking about Red Dead Redemption 2, and I'm bringing you all the way to Quentin Tarantino, and I'm showing you how those two are connected, how art inspires art. Um, I think you'll really dig it. It's about a 20-minute episode. Enjoy. Uh, we also announce our special guest for tomorrow's uh, Settlers of Catan stream, live Pacific time, 3 p.m. That one is 100% live. Virtual game. Everyone has their own Catan board. It's awesome. It's our flagship show. It's every Friday at 3 p.m. Uh, make sure you check it out. Uh, keep our numbers growing. It's been crazy. This community has been growing every week since we moved the channel here. And I'm so grateful and so appreciative. So please keep dropping those follows. Keep telling your friends about us. Keep telling your families about us. We're trying to entertain you guys during uh, all this. And we have a whole lot more. Not just video games, but some tabletop stuff coming too. So I appreciate you all tuning in. I'm Freddie Prince Jr. Love all y'all. I wish all y'all a very good evening and good game. Good head peace.